Okay, so number 45, what's the directions? So I need to aim, name the angle in four ways. Do you have one way? You could do it? Okay, there's... You, if... Well, the ways you can always do it. These are the ways you can always do it. Is find the side of the, tri the angle. Remember the angle is made up of two different rays, right? So find the side of the angle and pick out a point on the side. Then go to the vertex, pick out that point, which would be R. Then go to the other side and pick out a point on that R. So you want a point on the side, vertex, and a point on the other side. So the sure way of doing this, and it would work every time, would be like to go angle Q, R, S. And the same is exactly true if we did it the other way. It would be S, R, Q. So those two ways would work every single time. The main thing you've got to remember on this is that the vertex has to be in the middle. Okay? The vertex must be in the middle. If I were to say, and this is wrong, if I were to say angle R, Q, S, if I was just saying angle RQS, that means I would be talking about this angle here. That angle there would be angle RQS. Even though the lines aren't drawn, that would be angle RQS. The vertex must always go in the middle. Okay, now two other ways that might work, might not work. No, we don't want to name it. We don't care if it's um, the classification of the angle. We just want to know the name of the angle. Yeah, so we could do angle four because it was labeled. Number somebody labeled it angle four. All right. How else could we do this one? And angle R. Now angle R will only work if you have the vertex here by naming the vertex. That only works if there's only one angle there. Okay? If I were to draw another line out of that angle, and now I say angle R, okay, what angle am I talking about? Am I talking about the big angle? Am I talking about this angle here or this angle here? There's three different angles. I cannot call it angle R. Okay? But even if there were other lines in between those two lines, by saying angle QRS, we totally know, okay, here's a side, vertex, side. And so by labeling three points, we can always get it right. Vertex in the middle, please.